Hello everybody, Kirk Gaming here, welcome back to another episode of Kingdom Hearts 2. In the last episode, we finished off Agrabah, saw a cutscene of Kyrie interacting with Axel and Pluto, uh, which was just, frankly, a little bizarre. And uh, finally, we are now, now on our way to Halloween Town. God, I can't wait. Let's get started. This is Halloween Town, right? Well, it sure does look like Halloween. <laughs> hey, it's Zero. How have you been, boy? Fuck yeah! Welcome everybody to Halloween Town. Oh my god, I love, I love the movie. I love this area in the games. Oh, I, I'm so happy to be here in the games. Woo. Oh fuck yeah! <laughs> All right, we got finishing leap. So let me turn these two off. And yeah, ourselves so finishing leap. Oh, we can keep magic lock on. I turned off. I figured I'd get rid of the fire boost because I don't think we do many things that involve fire. Maybe Valiform, I think, does. Um. A little bit. Any chance? Build the left hand weapon comes available as well. Alright. I think Valiform might give us some fire attacks, but that's about it. Oh, and this up. Engage. Now we can get Genie as well. Enemy attack, there's one of various forms. Enemy moves bring those enemies in close to attack. Alrighty. I don't think there's any real reason for us to be leveling up summons, because I don't think it really does anything for us beyond upgrading the summons themselves. Like, there's no outside ability I, don't, I can't think of that we get from them. So, that's oh, Zero's Creep. Seems to usually sleep in here. Ow! Why did that actually scare me? God damn it. <laughs> What's that for? Sora, Donald, and Goofy! Welcome back! And Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas? Don't you mean Happy Halloween? Of course! Halloween greetings from Jack Skellington, the Pumpkin King! Forgive me, I'm in a Christmas mood. You see, I'm running the show again this year, but I need Sandy Claus' blessing, so I'm off to Christmas Town. Sandy Claus? I think he means Santa Claus. Aren't these decorations wonderful? This year, Halloween Town's going to handle Christmas, too. But first, we have to visit Sally. She's working on something no self-respecting Santa Claus can do without. 
Come along, I'll show you. A Halloween Town Christmas. Want to go check it out? <laughs> Come on, hurry! Welcome everybody to Halloween Town. I want to show my good friends. I'm sorry, Jack. I I need a little bit more time. Oh. Well, that's all right. Just as long as it's ready for Christmas. But, Jack. I'd best be off. I've got to go get Sandy Claus right away. Wonderful to see you again. Goodbye for now. Go get Santa Claus. Please, Thora, I'm afraid something terrible will happen if Jack goes through with this. You can try that again. Sora? Are those strange looking fellows in the town square with you? Huh? What fellows? You know, the ones who wanted to spoil Halloween and Christmas? What are they called again? Heartless? They're definitely not with us. But Donald, Goofy, and I can get rid of them for you. And then we can go see Santa. But first, the Heartless. Oh, yeah. We're going to keep Goofy with us for the moment. All right. So Blazing Fury, Icy Terror, and Bolts of Sorrow. And applause, applause, which is the Blimic Man. So Jack kind of plays the same role as Donald and being kind of a mage. So fire, ice, lightning, fire boost, blizzard boost, thunder boost, MP haste, etc. Specifically. All in all, pretty good, pretty good stuff. All right. Now let's just have to count those kids to do anything, right? Maybe they should help me in their place. Now let's grab this big old chest. Which has the Halloween Town Town's map. Security system installed in Jack's house is working properly as expected. Um, I'd find the drain. Climb over it to something. Guillotine. A tool to chop items placed below. Cannot be used for food preparation. Oh, this are appearing. Jack wants to become Sandy Claus. I have a bad feeling about all this. I just hope nothing terrible happens. Let's go to fountain, hit it to activate. Alright, we've gotten a few clues in here actually. Let's go ahead and explore. Now hear this, you you fiends! Leave Halloween Town at once by order of the mayor! 
Jack, where are you? I'm only an elected official. I can't handle this by myself. Jack! We're on it. Defeat all the heartless. Be enough. Let's go ahead and use Valor form for this. I'm also quite curious how it looks. Oh, they changed the mask. And uh, the gloves glow red at least. What else we got? Oh, come on. Technically, I think wisdom form could have also worked here because there's a lot of weaker enemies around. But ah, well, I want it. I want to level up battle form a bit. We'll get opportunities in the future. I know uh, there's gonna be one place during the series actually I'll end up grinding because it's just frankly that good for uh, grinding up wisdom form. Damn. Hell yeah, we managed to grab that early, thanks to trying to do it during combat. Alright, we got more to go. God damn, the fountain. Oh, yeah, do I need to finish off the fountain? Is that what it's waiting on me to do? Uh, what's the button that... That's me. I can't seem to actually focus on it. There we go. I guess we didn't have to hit the fountain after all. I started to think that maybe that was the case. How oh, was Santa Claus supposed to relax with all this going on? That's it, fellas. Santa Claus needs bodyguards. Are you up to the task? Us? Yeah. What should we bring along next time? A bucket full of caterpillars! Or something even worse! Who's that? Some old hag. Silence. A witch? Hmm. Perhaps you three could be of use to me. Come along, all of you. I'll show you the true meaning of mischief. All right, bodyguards. Christmas Town is this way. The doorway is in the woods just past the graveyard. All right, but first. Is that about. Ow, okay. Is that about putting items underneath, but it doesn't seem like that's the case. Okay, and that's activating the fountain. Got it. Ow. Well, there's uh, the guard system for Jack's house. I think that's what all the notes said about. And I don't think there's anything really else around. That's to the graveyard, that's up to the house. I don't think there's anything else really. Uh, we did get a new item. Okay. Oh, just another... Just some more materials. Not really worth... Cook. Covering. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Yeah. There we go. A couple more things. Yeah. Alright, which way are we supposed to be heading? Is it... Not this way, I'm assuming. Yeah. I'm assuming... Yeah, it's not like me, so I assume once the battle's over... Oh, the gate is chained shut. Alright, I'm assuming that's the way to, um... Well... Well, that's the way we don't need to go right now. Ooh, drive boost! If that does what I think it does, then... Hell yeah! Man, we've got a lot of good items. Uh, well, a lot of new things, rather. Let's see, drive boost. Oh, it's greater restoration of the drive gauge during MP charge. But more. Ooh! What else can I unequip? 
No, I'm not equipping that. Um, hmm. Never hit square, so maybe one of the uh, square moves. Never come square, not find the edge and come over square. I never guard, let's be honest. I think I guard more accidentally than I do intentionally. As soon as we get any more AP, I'll of course immediately equip that back on, but I'm sure we'll be okay for the moment without it. Alright. Apparently that's during MP charge, which is, uh, you know, after all our MP is used. And is that true? Let me just... During MP charge. But yeah, I guess... Hmm, I didn't know it worked like that, actually. Well, no, never mind. I was, for some reason I had a moment of thinking that it was like... It always in improves it or something. And what I might end up doing is, more often than not, just using Cure at the start of battles. Just so that way. Oh, perfect. Uh, I might just start using Cure at the start of combat. Just so that way we don't have to worry. Just so that way we get the drive boost going. Uh, there we go. There's a... Uh... Was there any other magic? Oh, there's the limits, I guess. But I think... Yeah, that's the... Yeah, unless we're using limits at the... all the time at the very start of battle. Oh, that might not be a bad call either. Hang on. Uh... Let's get rid of that, put on auto limit. Oh, well actually we had an item boost, I guess. So that way, more often than not, we should be able to just use limit right away and then immediately start uh, running our drive gauge back. Look at this mysterious door, I'm just looking at it makes my one's bones tingle. Yeah, I'm getting closer. I have something to tell you. Doug may, not, may have said it wants to be Santa. I'm not sure, sure that's a good idea. Not for me to even imagine at Christmas with Jack as Santa. And I don't, I'm don't excited to see Santa, but I have a bad feeling about this too, like Sally. Nah, I'm sure it'll be fine. Let's head in the door. Here it is, the door to Christmas Town. The spooks of Halloween can get so tiresome year after year. I wanted something new. And I found this. Beyond this door is a world filled with wonders, the likes of which you've never seen. At first, I couldn't believe my eyes. Everything was so fresh and exciting. Come on, just open it. In his workshop. Shall we? Ooh. Welcome everybody to Christmas Town, Yuletide Hill, Hill. and this is where we're going to be leaving it for today. Unfortunately. Let's see. Oh, those are pretty cool. I don't think we'll be buying any of them. Let's hand in all our materials. Ooh, we got an AP boost. Nice. We don't have any recipes, but for free development. Let's see. 
that will save me only two micro shards, so I don't think I'll use that just yet. Especially because we've only got the one. And I'll double thing. There we go. Technically could make a couple more of these things, but nah, it's fine. Alright. And let's go ahead and just use up that AP boost and equip this on something. On, this thing on somebody. Uh, same deal, just in, for electric attacks instead. Uh, Goofy has a free space, so let's give him that one. Uh, and just to be clear, yeah, that wasn't any better. Cool. Alright, we're gonna leave it here, so next time... You know what, actually, one more thing. We're going to end the episode off in just a moment. Uh, but let's just check the puzzle pieces, because why not? In a little bit. Since we've checked them last. I don't think we've found the last piece of heart, unfortunately. Oh. Oh, okay. There we go. We're only missing four pieces now for duality. Frontier. There we go. Daylight uh, is kind of complicated. As you can see, the blue lines indicate the borders, which is nice. But also, uh, yeah, it's going to be a little tricky to really figure out anything of that one for a while. Not until it's mostly full, anyway. At any rate, let's going to do it. Next time, on Kingdom Hearts 2, we're going to be heading over... Christmas Town. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys then. Bye bye.